head back up. I'd say this is our way back. How long to get back? If we're unlucky, maybe a week. And if we're lucky? We stumble over Bartrand's corpse on the way. <laughs> home sweet home. Finally. Oh, I wonder if Bartrand came back to the city. You think I'd be that lucky? Batra needs to die. Just make sure you let me know when you find him. Trust me, you'll be the first to know. <laughs> the treasure we found in that crypt far outstrips Bartrand's stupid idol. He'll be green with envy when he finds out. As soon as I get the chance, I'll look up my contacts to make sure we get the best price. I imagine you'll want to head home, tell your family the good news. We're going to be rich. Pitching. So you're back. No, oh, thank the Maker. Please uh, talk some sense into him. Carver, what are you wearing? I've joined the Templar Order. There's no point in trying to talk me out of it. It's done. What about me? You realize that you're related to an apostate. See, Mother? I told you he'd only think of himself. I want to be someone. Like Father wanted. Like I want. This is my chance. Carver, please. The order is so dangerous. I'll be fine, Mother. You don't need to worry about me. And you don't need to worry about me turning you in. I know the value of family. Well then. Whoa, well, my stuff moved. So the champion's brother was a Templar. Yes, but that's not the connection you're looking for. Isn't it? How else did an apostate remain invisible for so long without help from within the Templars? And the champion's companions? Meryl, Aveline, Isabella, that warden Anders. Don't remind me. I introduced them. We thought they all came from Ferelden together, but now it makes sense. Motive and opportunity. It's still not what you think. Then I need to hear more. Unless you've already decided. I can always go if you don't need me anymore. Tell me what came next. The treasure we found in the deep roads made us a fortune. The champion moved up in the world. Literally. Bought a mansion in Hightown. Everyone knew who he was now. Even the Viscount was taking notice. Carver joined the Templars, just as he said he would. He didn't turn in the champion, at least. Three years later, the Kunari. Still haven't left. Not Granari there. insisted they were waiting for their ship. But some of us knew better. Da, da, da. Smells like trouble's brewing. Bird. Bird. compound was not meant to be permanent. There are concerns the Kunari influence is no longer contained. Oh well. Was it ever? Kirkwall has tension enough between Templar and Mage. But these Kunari... 
They sit like gargoyles waiting for maker knows what and everyone goes mad around them. Nearly four years I've stood between fanatics. And now, this. Papers. Don't keep us in suspense. Leave us. Meredith at my throat, Orsino at my heels, and a city scared of heretical giants. Balance has held because the Conari ask for nothing. Even the space in Lowtown was a gift to contain them. But now, the Arishok has requested you. By name. What did you do? Uh... Again around. I can't help it if I make an impression. Apparently not. I remember how you helped my son. It seems you are meant to have influence above your station. Speak to the Arishok. Give him what he needs to keep the peace. Can you do that for Kirkwall, Sarah Hawk? Uh what does Sarishok want? Any idea what I can expect? None. Honestly, I don't think I've heard two direct words from the Arishok. Other than his rather deliberate phrasing of begone. If you think he's asking me to notify you of this is strange, well, you would be right. Do you fail war? The Canari usually arrive as conquerors. Odd that this has gone on so long. Very, and I have no interest in antagonizing them. That is partially why I suffer being a messenger today. A treaty exists, and it has been honored. Although... Uh, you have doubts. They claim they're waiting for a second ship. But it has been three years. They want something else. Hmm. How is your son? Have the years been kind to Seamus? He is his own man. But your actions tempered him somewhat. He's not so angry at the world. I thank you for that. I may not agree with him on many things, but uh, I am proud of what he is becoming. Who is against the Canary? I've seen hate for them, but I haven't heard anything major in years. Zealots are bravest where their lies can't be argued, behind closed doors. Chantry leaders see Canary beliefs as a challenge, not an attack. But the message gets muddled among casual adherents. I'm certainly not equipped to argue the fine points of faith. Why not expel the canary? Sounds like you'd be better off without this headache. They will not leave, and we don't have the resources to force the issue. At least, not in a way that would leave the city intact. If they had come to conquer, I suspect they would have done so. I'll have a price. I'm not going to ask the Viscount man. So I'll just say, of course I'll help. I am always willing to assist. Well, that is an attitude this city has lacked for a long time. Appease the Arishok. Take his demand and let him return to dormancy. As awkward as this has been, it is better than the alternative. Stepping down is looking more and more appealing. Guard Captain's rent plate. If that's further Babylon. Good day, sir. Well, you have certainly risen through the rank. Good for you. Gee. Hello. Seamus, wasn't it? The Viscount's boy. You're here rather often, Sir Hawk. A good influence, I think. Even by not taking sides, you helped start something. I still accept no blame for defending Kunari. And I don't miss the kinship of the people who oppose what I believe. Black Hat 4? I need a different colour. Uh, don't like or hate Kunari. The Arishok asked for me. I think they're a headache, but so are many people. And you've already treated them with more grace than most. Mere existence should not be an offence. No matter how they challenge the Chantry. Not when some of their ideas are so... compelling. 
another time, when things are better. Please keep it quiet, Sherrard. The Viscount. Black powder or something. Nothing like this. So we can actually come all the way up here now. There's a nice mug there. It's a giant statue. Nothing. Okay. Nothing like the smell of fresh Nothing like the smell. Hope the day is treating you well, Sarah. Sarah. We closed all these doors. A fine day. Indeed. Scarrow. Fine day indeed. Hello. We'll need to give them answers by tomorrow, Captain. I'll have them. Dismissed. The Seneschal was particularly vocal. Dismissed. You'd think the Captain of the Guard could requisition a Templar or two, but no, that would be demeaning. Can't have them working for the people when eternity needs a nanny. <sighs> That's not my job. That's why I remain unimportant. Less pressure. As if the return of the Amels hasn't set Hightown on its ear. As long as it's off its ass. Sure. <sighs> Have your fun. But the coin you poured into Kirkwall tipped what balance there was. My success is your headache. I didn't realize I was making it worse by getting ahead. I'm just harassing you. Although you are a bit like the center of a hurricane. You've changed fortunes for many people, not always for the better. Need more resources? Sounds like you're spreading yourself pretty thin. There are a lot of people in my charge. Someone has to look out for them. You guard the guardsmen? I don't turn people loose like Jevon. There's additional training, doubled patrols. Costs are up, but I've halved injuries. I'll take it and argue with Seneschal Bran later. You knew Jevon left a mess. After the last captain, you couldn't have expected this to be easy. At least I had the guards on my side. Once they understood, they rallied. And those who didn't weren't fit to hold the crest. Stack friends against the enemies. I don't know if I came out ahead, but it's for the better. Uh, you love it. Grouse all you want, but the Aveline I know doesn't regret a second as captain. They'd have to drag me out of here. And I'm sure some are lining up to try. You among them, I bet. Haven't had much time to follow you around. Not that I need to. I can trust that you at least try to do right. But I'm with you if you need me, Hawk. Just say the word. Calling on the captain. It's been three years and I've been sitting on my arse. Fine my day, How much longer do I have to wait? Oh, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you, Messiah. If only you humans didn't all look the same. <laughs> Dwarves are so varied. We can't all be short and bearded like your people, Bodan. Indeed. It's quite a shame, really. <laughs> I came to deliver this to you. The last of the proceeds from all that treasure you found in the deep roads. It seems your friend Varric found a buyer after all, yes? Quite well done. You ran all that way. So you raced here just to give me this? Oh, I didn't want to be responsible for so much coin. Just holding that purse was making me sweat. Uh, before I go, may I simply say how grateful I am that you've allowed my boy to stay in your home. I said I would repay you for saving Sandal's life, and I shall serve you faithfully. It is good to know he is safe. Uh, 
That's one more mouth. Let me guess. This was Mother's idea? <laughs> As you say, yes. I'll leave you to your adventures. Your mother asks that you return to the mansion when you have a chance. Fifty gold. Oh, I saw the level up sign. Just keeping the peace. Good for you. So now we've gone from low town to high town. I bad I only made 50 gold back. I hope the Kunari never move into high uh, no, no chest. There we go. Nice shield up. Now into the hawk estate. Again. You've settled in nicely. It's just luck. And skill. Indeed. Still, more coin never hurts, right? Say, if someone wanted to pass some work your way... Everybody needs something. So, how can I be of service this time? Someone's trying to be a guard. Poorly. Remember Emmerich, the Templar? He wants your help, and some sort of official sanction. Official sanction? For his... investigation. He's convinced that every random murder in the past few years is connected, and he won't be quiet. Hmm. You sure he's wrong? Seems like it should be easy to prove if there are bodies. Kirkwall isn't the safest place. That doesn't mean everything terrible is related. There's no sense to that. Can't be. Why not check it out? You don't think it's worth investigating? I have. He even convinced one of my lieutenants to raid the Dupuis mansion. Nothing there. You wouldn't believe how much ass I had to kiss after that, bloody hobbyist constable. Why can't he spend his declining years building a boat or something? Huh. He had a good start. I seem to recall he had some good leads. Then you won't mind chasing his threads. If it leads somewhere, I'll pick it up. Right now, he's just distracting my men. He's in the gallows. Do what you can. Thanks, Hawk. I'll try not to make a habit of this. Prime suspect. Oh boy. Uh, a lot of letters. Greetings, I hope this letter finds you well. I've often thought of you in these past three years. By your kindness, my Fenriel would have been long since sold to slavers. Instead, he has thrived and begun to master his magic. But now his nightmares have caught up with him. Neither the Keeper nor the First Enchantment know how to help. I don't know where else to turn. Please go to my home at Alienage. I will be waiting to speak with you. Thank you again for the compassion you have shown Fenriel in the past. Sincerely yours, Ariane. No from Fenrir. Too hard. Life for the Dalish hasn't been easy. Keep Mar Marifari tries her best, but I don't know what else she could do for me. The young girls want to set me, and after hear them whispering behind my pack, the elders have more discretion, but I can see it in their eyes they're afraid of me. I don't know why I'm telling you this. Sometimes it feels like you're the only person I could trust. Okay. Feeling inadequate. Okay. Again. Again, spam. 
in males. What the heck? Special sauce. Mr. Hook, I feel I must apologize. You did what you had to when you turned Kelda over to the guards. You saved my daughter, and I should have been more thankful. Leah has been difficult. We left Kirkwall behind. But my poor girl now thinks every man is a monster in disguise. I fear she may never get past this. Who is that again? Kelda. Oh, that's the... That was a crazy killer guy. Okay. I am Lord Echim Falk Stockhaven. I have faith in the Maker and the Dresty, his beloved prophet. Blah blah blah, Seneschal. I have been deposed out his by His Highness had fortune 11,000 sovereigns. Locked right in the vault of Bank of Ativa and simply said, Oh my god, it's another spam mail. Hawk. Heard you lot got to the free marches. Don't know why you bother, but I suppose it's better than no lie. We got spiders up there, big ones. Couldn't swing a dead cat around here without hitting a joint spider. But the blind drove him off, make her. Dog dies head, mark my words. Man can't even cover his blind lens with poisonous traps. Oh, Barlin. Uh, good old Barlin. He survived. No room from Origins. Gambling and men. It was two months late, Sarah. Interesting cures. Okay. Debts. Message from Lovering. Dear Leander, I hope you and the children are holding up. I'm so sorry about Bethany. Such a dear girl. I about her helping me weed. Oh, doing the weed. The plight is taking too much from us. I have to make her for the hero of Ferelden and the Grey Wardens. Things are slowly getting back to normal in most of the country. But Lovering is gone for good. We hope to rebuild there, but the blight poisoned the land. It will take decades for the earth to recover. May never. Redcliffe is a right place. I was sad to see it as a home. The village has some trouble during the blight, but it's recovering. Perhaps you could visit sometime. Please write me again, my dear. I wish to hear about your life in Kirkwall. Here we go. Dear Darrett, how are you? I hope you and mother are doing well. Because of good here, I found my place among the Templars. It's nice to have purpose, to be part of something bigger than myself. And you. Alright, alright, I'll stop being a pain in the eyes. It's not a perfect job, though. I don't really like what we do to mages, but do we have a choice? It keeps everyone safe and it's better than the alternative. Many mages understand that we're trying to help, even if our methods could use improvement. Unfortunately, there are extreme elements within the order. Some argue for a permanent solution. They have ideas I hope never take root. It makes me glad Bethany never had to live in a place like this. I'll wrap this up, duty calls, send my love to mother. Okay. It's strange living here again. My childhood home. Now owned by my child. It's not something I could have imagined when I was a little girl staring out this window. I'm still grateful you used your money from the expedition to buy back the estate. I feel like an Amel again. Little hawk. Don't step on on airs. Just don't go all pompous on me, all right? I promise. If there's one thing I learned in Ferelden, it's that good people can be born in a hut as easily as a palace. Honestly, after so many years as a peasant's wife, it feels strange to have nothing to do. 
I visited Carver with the Templars, and he's so proud of his new knighthood. I guess I just need to start finding you a suitable wife. What? Find me a wife? What the heck? Wish Bodan would clean the fireplace. Says it reminds him of a mine shaft. Winston. I like the doggy. <coughs> <laughs> Maybe Sandal picked up some Mabari speak from our time at the hero of Ferelden's camp. Apparently. Hello. If you need any enchantments, I'm sure my boy would be happy to help. Enchantments? Just so. Ooh, enchantments. Enchantments. Didn't Fenris say all to Vinter wine is made from the blood and tears of slaves? I hope he was exaggerating. Hmm. Ah, Carver. Still as resentful as ever. Ah, this statue. Wait, where did I get this statue? Box. <laughs> Another copy of Anders' manifesto. Has he been stuffing them into all the books? Uh, won't be doing the steel scene a bit. Just uh, explore it first. Is that Isabella? Who carves that into a stairwell? Dang, damn it, Isabella! That's Mother's room. I shouldn't intrude. Handprints was someone swinging on the chandelier. Sando. Oh, that cheeky little blogger. I should get some curtains. I've got curtains. Okay, cut to this. Okay. Oh, nice comfy bed. Which you can't examine it. Nothing works now. Finery. Which is what I'm wearing. Buff off. Ah, oh, it's good to be important. Okay. Let's save. Boom, bada, bang, boom. 